We've got tips and recipes for healthy living. So for fun and inspiration, come and join us in the raw food world. Welcome everybody, this is Matt Monarch with the Raw Food Real TV Show and happy November 1st, Sunday. I am just on it. And we are just frolicking in the fairy woods of Asheville, North Carolina. And we are just loving the most beautiful colors. Look at that hairy vine. And this hairy vine <laughs> crawling up the tree right there. We're just loving it, aren't we? It's very beautiful. Apparently these are the busiest two weeks of the year in Asheville, North Carolina because the colors, all the autumn colors of the trees, it's so beautiful here. It's kind of crazy. I wouldn't have thought this was the busiest time of year, but I mean, it makes sense. It's beautiful. The leaves are turning colors equals busy times in Asheville, North Carolina. And I am so excited to make this announcement. Should I do it, baby? Do it. I am so excited about this. <clears throat> Angela Stokes Monarch got approved to leave the United States during this process to, for the become a citizen. Woo! All the way until October 2010. And I got off the phone with J David Wolf just a minute ago. And May 2010. May 2010 in Vilcabamba is happening. What's happening? Ladies and gentlemen, we are having the ultimate raw food extravaganza get together raw food world conference in Vilcabamba on May 4th to May 14th. I believe that the entire town square of Vilcabamba is just going to be frolicking with raw foodists from all around the world, including Angela Stokes Monarch, myself, David Wolf, the Wheatgrass Messiah, and many more. Is there going to be a tiramisu consistency? There is going to be tiramisu <laughs> consistency quality everywhere. <laughs> I am excited. I'm very excited. Angela, we weren't even sure it was happening yet, and Angela was like talking about it in every single one of her talks. It's ridiculous. So, May 2010, Vilcabamba, book your calendars now. It's going to be a kind of free flow festival, just so you know. No one's actually organizing it. It's just a kind of like turn up and meet the tribe and enjoy yourself kind of thing. Um, it's a very, very fertile, abundant area, so there's just food everywhere and probably people will be going and taking foraging walks and um, maybe putting things up on boards in the town square like I'm going to do a talk at this time on this day or come to my yoga class at this time so don't expect like structure <laughs> absolutely and every day what we do is we're just going to meet in the town square where there's a juice bar of organic fresh produce picked from these young people's farms and then we're gonna go on hikes and all crazy things like we did last time. May 2010, Vilcabamba. I'm excited. And on a side note, for those of you who have noticed that my blog has been taken down, um, this happens every once in a while when someone utilizes their blog on a daily basis. Google gets a little concerned and so what they do is they close it down and they kind of check to make sure it's not a spam blog. So it's there still. Probably this week, within the next couple of days, probably by Wednesday, that bad boy will be up and you guys will get emails again when TV shows come out. Yeah, that happened to me. Some of you might remember when I was first doing my blog, when I was juice feasting, my blog got closed down for about a week. So you just got to wait and then it comes back again. Okay, so on this journey that Angela and I have been through over the last month, we were in Florida for about three weeks and it completely knotted my hair up. I don't know about you guys, but like <laughs> I've got like one big dread on my head right now. And um, Angela tonight actually stated that she was going to untangle it. Yep. It's one of my monarch duties. <laughs> It'll only take about three hours. Um, she doesn't like when I do it because I like pull out like one fourth of my hair every time I do it because I'm just like <laughs> and I get like these big things of hair. My hair just gets thinner and thinner as I do that every single time. 
but uh, the Florida weather definitely destroyed that. And a lot of people are wondering what type of hair products we always use. There was a certain time in there where um, I was washing my hair like every two days and everybody was like, oh my God, your hair's so beautiful. What do you do to wash? What do you do to make it like that? Da, 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 da. The only reason I was washing it every two days was because um, that whole scapey situation, I was kind of scared it was in my hair, so I was like just taking care of everything possible. Um, but yeah, I'm not that, we're walking through mud here. I'm not that keen on uh, washing my hair often. To be honest with you, I don't even know the last time I washed my hair. Do you know, babe? I would think a couple of months ago. A couple of months ago, maybe a month ago, I don't know. But usually, I, I try to do it like every few weeks. But uh, tomorrow, you'll see the difference. We'll talk about the products and what we do, and it'll be a lot of fun. So. Got to tell them about the blender. The blender! Dun, da, da, da. Now, a lot of you probably aren't, they, you don't subscribe to Angela's rawreform.blogspot.com. She doesn't. Why? I, why? Why aren't you just, why? Why aren't you subscribed to her blog? Because if you were subscribed to her blog, you would know that you have the chance to win a free Blend Tech blender that we're giving away Woo! for free. And this contest has been going on for a month, but since we didn't talk about it on the TV show, we're going to extend it for one week. Yes, one week. We're going to extend it till Sunday at midnight. November the 8th. November the 8th. Next Sunday. Maybe you can tell them what the contest is. Yeah, you, well, if you go to my blog, you can check out the details about it. Um, we're just really excited. We get to give away a Blendtec blender. And um, to win, you just got to send in a video explaining why you want to win the blender. And you got to make us giggle. We want to laugh. We want to so have a giggle chop? We do want to have a giggle chop. Your video is going to be no longer than three minutes. And yeah, tell us why you want to win the blender. Make us laugh. There have been some very good entries already, I've got to tell you. Um, but don't be afraid to send your entry in. Just put it up on YouTube or something and send us the link. To Angela at rawreform.com. And I think the chances of winning are pretty good. I mean, there have been a good amount of entries, but I mean, it hasn't been a crazy amount of entries. And um, right now, you know, we're looking at three that I'm really liking that we're trying to choose between. So, come on, get that free blind tech and see what you can do. Go to rawreform.blogspot.com that has not been taken down because of spam and figure that out. Okay, well, we're going to continue our little frolic through fairyland here. And we've got... Angela Sticks Monarch. And Matt Monarch, and we'll see you again tomorrow at the Raw Food World TV show. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you again at the Raw Food World.